Hi, it's Jennifer. Uh, several months ago, I shared how I store all of my favorite inks. There's a few different systems that I use, and I will put a link here and in my YouTube description and over on my blog to that older video. I have since updated one part of my ink storage, and I thought that you guys might like to see it. It's not a huge change, but it's something that I definitely love. So for my most used inks, I keep them in a cabinet here. I also have a system for distress ink that's in a different place. I use those all the time. But for my most used inks, I have them in a cabinet right by where I work. And they're in these white storage units from Organize More. Now if you saw my first video, you'll know that this looks pretty much the same. The piece that has changed is this large piece that I have set back into my cabinet. This piece can be hung on the wall or stand up on its own. Before, the large piece I had in here had pretty large slots in it that were pretty wide so that they could hold Stampin' Up! inks. And those slots were a little bit too wide for the inks that I use most, most like the Hero Art Shadow inks, the Simon Says Stamp inks, um, any of the Memento Lux or any of the pigment inks. They, it was way too wide, so there was a lot of empty space. I'm excited to see that Organize More now offers a size that has narrow slots to it, so it makes better use of the space. So for this large unit, instead of holding just 48 ink pads, it now holds 60, and there are other sizes available. What I do like is that the ink pads still stick out a little bit from the storage unit so that you can easily take one out and grab it and go. And you can also see down on the ink colors on the lid if you want to, but I label the sides of my inks. Now if you have their last unit, it's re really very similar. Um, it just has, this just has narrow cubbies to it. So if you've been considering getting one of these um, storage units from Organize More, you may want to check out the different options they have. If you go over to my blog, I'll be giving a discount code and doing a giveaway, so be sure to check it out. I just think this is a great product and it really helps me to stay organized and easily grab the inks that I use the most often. So this new unit uh, holds 60 ink pads, as I mentioned. It's approximately 18 inches wide, 16 inches high, and 3 and a half inches deep. Uh, each cubby is about 3 and a quarter inches wide and 1 inch high, which is great for any of your basic inks like Versamark, Stazon, pig, most pigment inks, uh, Hero Art, Shadow inks. Many inks will fit into this. You can check whatever inks you have and make sure if you want to. Now, I will mention that there I do have in my other video many other ink storage options. So if you click here or check my YouTube description where I'll have a link or over my blog, you can see some of the other ink storage options I have. One is a smaller unit. I have this one actually stuck to the inside of my cabinet door. You probably saw that earlier. For distress inks, I have another system. This one's also from Organize More. Both of these are. And this one, I actually have my ink blending tools in it. I've since switched to the circular ink blending tools, the mini ink blending tools, but I use that same storage unit. And I actually have this one laying in my uh, drawer, and I just pull it open. By the way, I don't worry about which way my ink pads are oriented. Most companies say it really doesn't matter. And then one of the other options I show in that video is um, this drawer. This is actually an IKEA drawer that you just pull out and it has all of my inks kind of scattered in there and these are the other inks that I don't use as often as the ones I've showed you earlier. Also in that other video that I mentioned, I show these clear containers that I keep in my cabinet for some of my other inks that I use often. This option is a great one if you're limited on space. These containers are fantastic. And again, I show that in the other video. So basically, the only thing I've changed in my ink storage system from, since the last video is that large Organize More unit that I showed you at the beginning of this video. For links to all the products that I used here, you can check my YouTube description, where I also will have a link to the other ink storage video. You can also go to my blog at jennifermaguireinc.com for much more, including that Organize More, more discount code and giveaway. I also wanted to mention again that I am not affiliated with Organize More. I just bought their products and really liked them and contacted them and they offered a discount code and giveaway. They're really nice people. I hope this inspires you to organize your inks. I know it has helped me a lot. Thanks for watching.